let's have a look at the last part of this question. So suppose the demand for this firm's production is the following function. What's going to be the optimum production level and the profit? Okay, so we have the price. We have the total cost function, which we found in the previous video. Recall that to make profit, we want to be smart about investments and we want to make marginal revenue equal to marginal cost. So marginal revenue equal to marginal cost. Now to find out the marginal revenue is quite fast because that's going to be the price function with twice the slope. So the marginal revenue would be 25 minus 2 times 3, which is 6 times the quantity. The marginal cost is just the derivative of the total cost. So it's the derivative of the total cost with respect to the quantity, which is equal to the derivative of the quantity, the derivative of the quantity with respect to quantity. And that's equal to 1. Now with this in mind, we can calculate the optimal quantity. We can calculate the equilibrium quantity. Marginal revenue equals to our marginal cost, which means that 25 minus, minus 6q, 25 minus 6q is equal to 1. So we have 25 minus 1, that's equal to 24, equals to 6q. And that gives us in equilibrium a quantity of 4 units. So the equilibrium quantity is equal to 4 units. Now we can use this to calculate the equilibrium price because we have the price function given to us. So the price function will give us 25 minus 3 times the quantity of 4. So that's 25 minus 12 and that's equal to an equilibrium price of 13. Now this in mind, we have to calculate our, our profit. What is our profit? The profit will be the difference between the total revenue and the total cost. Now what is the total revenue? The total revenue is equal to the price times the quantity and the total cost, we know that that's, that's equal to Q. So minus Q. Now what is the price? It's 13, quantity is 4. Let's substitute the values over here. So the profit will be 13 times 4 is going to be our total revenue minus the quantity of 4 of 4 so 13 times 4 that's equal to uh, this is 40 4 times 3 12 so 52 minus 4 and that's equal to 48 that's going to be the profit for the firm and we are done